Hello everybody, welcome to Season 49, uh, first round match between Vade and Trenner, both new names to me, probably new names in the cup, uh, Undead versus Lizardmen. In the booth with me is Kalon. hello! Hello! Uh, yeah, new names to me as well, Jim. Fantastic to see new uh, blood coming through. Um, and uh, yeah, looking forward to seeing how this one goes. So, looking at this, looks like a fairly nicely built lizard team. Yes. Rookie Crocs is about the only small little thing there, but this is, uh, yeah, love all of the block guard. Is really, really tasty. Bit of Mighty Blow, bit of Tackle. Lots of Mighty Blow. <laughs> Lots of uh, Mighty Blow. That is a horrendous amount of Mighty Blow. Yeah. yeah. These three, you know, Triffic would want all these three to have guard instead of Mighty Blow, but it's still yes. very rowdy, yeah, very rowdy team. Yeah. And he's, he's obviously TV efficient. He's got a wizard against, like, wow. a kind of generic undead team. But at least the undead team has a tackle yeah. bomber. It does, yeah. This is one of the nicer of the uh, undead teams. Uh, there was uh, on the draw, which you can watch on uh, on the YouTube. If you haven't seen the draw for the YouTube, it is one of the videos underneath this. Anybody on YouTube, you should go and watch that so that you can uh, see all of the teams that are in the cup mm. and uh, get our uh, insights into how they were all built and how they went along. Yes. Um, but yeah, this is uh, definitely one of the nicer of the of the undead teams because um, he's got a t tackle bomber basically yeah that that yeah. that is what I found from my yeah. my low yeah. TV undead run was if I'd had a tackle bomber I could have beaten like one of the best teams in the cup in the first round um, uh, 100% yeah and uh, and you were close to doing it as well mm. um, just because you know you're so good at blood ball yeah. and uh, <laughs> if uh, yeah, uh, what it was just. Oh wow, that's a pretty nice hit. Well, mighty no, blow, uh, mighty blow, doing a thing. Was it necessary? Is there? A, is, is he got frenzy or something? No, it was actually better out there. <laughs> yeah, it was better out there, wasn't it? Mm. He's failed his failed his pickup now. We can imagine that he really the pickup. <laughs> I was, I was looking to watch some good blood ball here. I'm, jo I'm joking. I'm joking. Obviously. <laughs> Uh, it was perfectly fine and perfectly okay to decide to want to do the GFI. It probably was better where he was, but no, he didn't want to give away the hit on the uh, on that guy. I think it was. I think it was. Oh. I think it was bad to GFI. But yep, fair enough. <laughs> wow, there you go. Uh, That's a good hit. Yeah, really, really good hit with a <laughs> uh, a a zombie managing to get rid of a lizard on the first hit. Mm. He's piling on this. That's rowdy as balls. Well, hey, great pile on. Ooh. And this is why you always pile on and you never listen to the naysayers yeah. who say you always Yeah, just pile on straight away. On. Yeah. Always pile That was, oh, man, that was rowdy as balls. Like, <laughs> like, look at the situation here. I think it's uh, fine. Like, he doesn't, it stops him getting okay. mighty blood. Like, it's a, it's safety and he can't foul you because he's, you know, he's, he's got 11 I mean, man. he can, he can clear team. it pretty easily. Oh, it's a bit trickier now that he's moved that guy. Okay, like he can't foul because he's eleven man lizard team, can he? I mean, oh, maybe course. he can. Yeah. Maybe he can foul, but yeah. if he does, it's risky from his own part, isn't it? Like just for the sending off. Even if he's he gone into fouls, gone into fight the mummies, doesn't seem like a particularly good idea either. Oh, it is if I it works. tell a lie. <laughs> Fucking amazing. It is if it I, works. I clearly know nothing about blood ball. <laughs> <laughs> uh, I thought the GFI wasn't all that bad, and uh, that you shouldn't go and fight mummies. <laughs> well, the problem is, is, like you know, he had the chance to hit. He had the chance to fight the mummy, and the thing is, he like, did, yeah. you can't stop them getting too deep. You, that's what that's like. That's the bad thing about the mummies. Uh, For sure, you can't really stop them hitting you. So, and you can't you can't run away from them because you're at one. Yeah. So, like, oh god. <laughs> yeah. So yeah, yeah, taking the chance to whack them while you can. But he's, he's down got like on everybody. There's no way he's not taking every hit he can. <laughs> yeah, for sure. It's uh, it's the problem here with uh, with lizards in general is when you lose one of them, uh, it starts to get pretty bad, and then when you lose two of them, you're kind of up shit creek. Yeah. Um, but maybe just don't take that hit with the because it's. I'm oh so it's not a rookie Crocs. It's a it's a guard stand firm from Crocs. Yeah. So yeah, maybe just don't take the hit. Oh. No, oh, maybe Jesus don't get everybody cast instantly. That's some good advice. <laughs> oh wow, another MNG as well. So <laughs> three cars in two me. turns. That's pretty ridiculous, right? Yeah, that is pretty ridiculous. Yeah. 
Four plus three if you count both teams. I mean, he, he, he made a Kaz on his first block as well, didn't he? He <laughs> did, but that guy really shouldn't. They shouldn't have had a ghoul open to no, get shouldn't. immediately hit by Tackle Mighty. No, he shouldn't have. Yeah. Well, admittedly, the Lizard player should have set up for the hit without requiring a GFI, but... He didn't require a GFI, he just chose yeah. to make one. <laughs> <laughs> Fair play. Fair play. <laughs> mm, we follow on here. Um, he, wants to, he wants to go over here so we can get there. Oh, he's got the wrong square. Okay. Yeah. Yeah, he has. And the ball goes in the middle there. And he's got a couple of threats here that he really needs to deal with. And he's not dealing with them. And goes for the 1D. Oh. And this uh, cage is based on both sides. Yep. Oh, wow. Okay, gets him on the second one. Yeah, this this Saurus had to go up here. Like he just he had, had to. to. Just had to, yeah. Just pretty crazy not to. Because, mm. uh, I mean, they're pretty shit skinks, but at least you've got some sidestep on the back, right? So it's tricky to get in there and do anything effective. But now it's just pretty straightforward. Just base him up and bang skinks. Oh, I'm surprised he didn't. Although I'd have tackle pawn that skink. So He's going to tackle pawn this skink instead. Yeah, I don't like that because if you no. to do that, you're getting hit by mighty blow, right? Yeah, it's not good. Oh, I guess you get sidestep in on the ball. Yeah, I much prefer tackle coming this way. <clears throat> yes, because everything just gets punched back now. Yeah, like you stop him for a turn, you stop him moving for a turn. You do, and you make him uh, activate his crocs really early, which he didn't need to do either, but um, <laughs> he did do it. You, yep, he did force him to choose to activate his crocs early here. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. Oh, wow. And there goes another reroll. Um, has made the box so he can get that guy out, but he gets absolutely zero uh, oh, move forward. Yeah, I was going to say, he should have made this block first, right? Then he would have got three dice yeah. on the goal, but it's because yeah, he was going to break tackle. Yeah, but it's because he was going to break tackle down so that he can get this guy out. And uh, that gives him another skink free here. So the skink can park on him. Away? It looks like Does he it. Know it's turn four. <laughs> um, yeah. And then gets this guy out as well. And uh, now that he's made the dodge, he can decide where he goes. Um. Okay, so zero rerolls for Trenner. Yeah. And, uh, yeah, you gotta say things are looking pretty good for Vade. I mean, the bad outcome here is that the Lizards score on turn five. Yeah. So, Did you know that this is, uh, this, this lizard man coach, he's, uh, he's Jeremy's brother, Tony? <laughs> <laughs> So I, I, uh, I'm, I'm trying to put it together. Vade? <laughs> no, no, Tony the lizard Vade? man. The lizard man. Oh. Jeremy Renner. <laughs> oh, Jeremy Renner. And so this then, is Tony yes, Renner. <laughs> yeah, Tony Renner. There we go. That's my head cannon. Yeah. Oh. He's, he's, a, he's, a, he's a Blood Bowl enthusiast. <laughs> he is. <laughs> this, is uh, this is pretty ridiculous, by the way. It's absolutely crazy. I mean, Mighty Blow is good, but it's not that good. <laughs> Like, we, we just watched a claw game that didn't do this much damage to orcs. Yeah. Yeah. Whew. Yeah, just quietly. Absolutely fucking crazy. Yeah. Amount of damage being done here. Really is. Yeah. And even well, a bit on the back end, like... As well. Even yeah. a bit on the back end is, is quite a lot. But yeah, the lizards have just been torn to shreds. GFI. Oh my god. <laughs> the GFI stuns him. <laughs> Fuck me. Stop rolling sixes. That's your problem, Tony Renner. <laughs> Fuck sake, Tony. <laughs> there you go. I'm glad, I'm glad this is uh, accepted Blood Bowl law now instantly. <laughs> yeah, yeah. I'll just go with this. I was like, oh, it's a bit of a stretch, but let's just go with it. <laughs> I've done enough impro improvisational classes to just go, yes, and? So, yeah, oh, okay. his name for forever shall be Tony Renner. Way. Do you know what I think he could have done here? Um, go on. I think Played he could have blocked thing. this guy with a blockless block. Then that gets the guard in here, which lets in three dice this skink, and then two dice that yeah. gets this guy. And then yeah. that's nice. Yeah, it is, yeah. Yeah, that would have been pretty pretty tasty, wouldn't it? Mm. 
But, but this way he gets to block with block, which is slightly better. Yeah, really. obviously better, yeah. And uh, like less likely to get shouted at by Artemis. And another stun! <laughs> Yep, just a stun. Stun there. Oh god, the fouls are starting now. Well, yep. seeing as his blocks have done this, the fouls are going to kill everything, right? Like, just ridiculously remove everything. No. <laughs> no? Oh, it's because he's a loner. So that guy brought his own armor. Oh god, the uphill. Yep. The up he, he has to uphill because he's got nothing left. <laughs> yeah. That's a, a having to uphill. Uh, a, a, a zombie? Yeah, a zombie. <laughs> Oh, and he sure hands failed. Wow. And now, probably now should have, uh, probably should have, yeah, he probably should have thought about moving people to this side in yeah. case of that bounce, because now that's a... Like he just instantly can do the stuff now. Yeah. Yeah, like this wow. is... Yeah, that's incredibly weak to this. That wow. was really, really terrible. I'll just fail his dodge anyway, so it's fine. Doesn't yeah. matter. <laughs> Well, this has been a bit of a comedy of errors, uh, you know, and just absolute carnage, obviously. Like, you can't blame Lizard Man. Coach, no, anything. you can't. No, for the amount of removals here has been just ridiculous. Yeah. Uh, this, is, this is not normal, ladies and gentlemen. <laughs> uh, but also, um, yeah, a little bit of um, <clears throat> chalice nerves, maybe. Yeah. A little bit of inexperience in, um, in, in, in what's going on overall. Yeah. To be fair, it's been a long time since we watched a game with two unknowns, um, and uh, fair play to them for managing to make it. So oh. anything we say from here on out is is, is purely for uh, the entertainment value of YouTube and Twitch, and nothing personal about the coach. Yep, and they certainly did better than me, who didn't qualify. So there you go. Indeed, uh, and 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 that's just that you didn't qualify this season. I'm just some shithead who's brought in because uh, in case there's any ladies present, they like my Irish accent. <laughs> well, hey. <laughs> yeah. So, uh, yep, <clears throat> I have a face fit for Twitch streams, uh, commentary, not, not, yeah, for radio. I was trying to make it modern, because yeah. you listen to the radio anymore. Yeah, I know, right? Radio's great as well. Really like the radio here. We've got really good radio. Oh my God. Another sure hands pick up fail, but this time he gets away with it. <clears throat> he does. Well, maybe, and, uh, because he's still going to get instantly 2D'd. He is instantly 2D'd. Uh, but he's got dodge. At wrestle also, like there were, you know, there's a good chance of getting down and then escape were very, to, to very run good around chance. and get it. Like that, that could have still ended up at one 0 to the lizards. Yeah. So uh, he does have a scoring threat, right? He does. Is yeah. It the mummy. Okay. It's uh, white. Ah, very good. So this is this is oh, definitely a, a white. Doable. He actually wants to score on as well. So yeah, it is very doable. Terrible block though, because. Oh no, I guess he can blitz. Is he blitzing with his but you can Oh well that's not great. Yeah, There's he's gonna double G5 blitz him. Well, yeah, yeah, because it to stop the dodge. I think I would have just dodged and uh, and blitzed. Yeah, but this way he gets to pile on, right? Yeah, but I mean he could I would have just blitzed the Saurus with like I said it was I yes. thought it was a bad block because I would have just blitzed yes. the Saurus with the tackle yes. bomb. Hundred percent. And he's going for the foul before the uh before the score attempt. Well And that's another <laughs> pretty pretty successful. Double double, so no score. But uh Jesus Christ. He cast his whole team. <laughs> Eight cast in the first, first half. In the first half. I don't think my tackle bomber would have been quite as successful as this, but <laughs> it's certainly, you know, we can definitely use this as proof that a tackle bomber is a good thing to have. <laughs> well, to be fair, like, quite a chunk of those were done by a block zombie. Yeah, yeah, yeah. So I don't think they're the entirely responsible for it. It's like that they... <laughs> Went through a chainsaw. Did it, Imelda Marcos, having got her son back in power, is uh, now needing more leather for her shoes. Uh, there's a really great 80s slam. There you go. Yeah. yeah. What the fuck is happening here? Yes. Well, the political here. intrigue coming from uh, <laughs> coming from all corners. Look at me and my topical references. <laughs> <laughs> Yep. Instant armor break. Oh, I forgot it was their drive now as well. Yeah, yeah, 
Yes, yeah. this is pretty much done. What's he got? He's got two Saurus and two Skinks? Yeah. No, no. No, no, he doesn't. <laughs> <laughs> Fuck me. <laughs> okay. Is there such a thing as a buy round? Because he needs one. Because yeah. uh, even if, 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 if the sure hands continues to not pick up the ball for the next eight turns, uh -huh. And it's a draw, and somehow goes to kicks. Uh, he does not have a team for the next game. <laughs> yeah. Uh, he'll have silly bla <laughs> <laughs> oh, What the fuck is this game? Well, to be fair, it had to balance out yeah. what's been happening so far. I don't think he will feel like it's balanced yeah. out. No, I, I guarantee he probably sent some message going like, Oh my god, did you see that? And the other guy's like, fuck off. <laughs> <laughs> Whoa, have you ever seen dice like this? No, I haven't. <laughs> <laughs> oh, my god. oh my god. Just wow. Uh, wizard comes in. He's just like, I wish no, my brother no, would right. shoot me in the face with a bow and arrow right now. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. <laughs> we need somebody in Trevor's corner. Uh, yeah. Oh, oh, man, this is just horrendous, isn't it? Yep. It's and like got a snuff film. <laughs> it really is, yeah. Yeah, it's like, you know, how handbags please, are made. Please 3D him. Please at He's least got a 3D him. He's got a 3D him. Yeah. At least three DM. At least. <laughs> Do we want a four yeah. dice? <laughs> no, but I, like, well, I think he's accidentally going to three DM because he needs to set up nicely for this foul. <laughs> yeah, to be fair, he failed the sure hands. He did. Yeah, the sure hands got terrible and didn't sure didn't he roll triple skulls there? Oh, Pro cool. failure. Only just gets him on the 3D. Yeah, on the 3D, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> rookie, rookie zombie, why not? Well, it was a level zombie now. <laughs> Way, well, yes. sure hands did a thing. He's literally leveled him. Jesus Christ. Yeah. <laughs> Leveling your zombie off murder is amazing. <laughs> Oh God. <coughs> you can legal concede at this point, right? Uh, yeah, but he doesn't want to concede because it, I mean he can legal concede, but he doesn't want to because it's the game. In fact, the game might legal concede him here because he can only set up one player. No, no, it's if you can't set up any, then the the ah, right, the, okay. the touchdown, cool. the the turn advances two squares and you get awarded advances two touchdown. squares and you get awarded a touchdown. So both of those stay out. So he's got one guy on the pitch. <laughs> this is fucking hilarious. <laughs> So he does have to play it out, though. So he gets to put the point on on, the, on whoever he wants, which is probably the um, the tackle pommel. The, the tackle the pommel to blitz Kaz and the then tackle. and then get fed yeah. a touchdown, right? Oh, well, he's already got pro. He's basically finished, Jim. What would you possibly give him? Uh, jugs, Gans, uh, Stanford. Jugs, of course, all of which he should have had before. Pro was the joke. <laughs> ah, a clever, mm -hmm. a clever joke from Kalon. Mm -hmm. mm -hmm. Comedy Central. I'm telling you. <laughs> the Jeremiah Mel Marcus one? <laughs> yeah. <laughs> it did very well with the certain age group. <laughs> the marketing has come back. Oh, three dice him, man. Come yes. on. Yeah, you've got it. You've got it. Come on. Dice him. But he's got one player on the field. <laughs> Even if he didn't have a mummy, like a strength three yeah. man, you should be three dice him. Yeah, seriously. Yep, yeah, there we go. So, pitch clear. Okay, yep. I, I just came in to say I was here when this happened. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Fucking hell. What a horrendous game, eh? Unreal. I mean, is this the first time in Chalice for Trainer? Yes, it is. Yeah. yeah. I would completely understand if he just uninstalls uh, uh, yeah. Blood Bowl yeah. and never plays it again. Yeah. Ideally, he uninstalls and then blames Rick for it. <laughs> that's, that's, the, that's the pro move. Oh, he's just going to go in. Yeah, so, like, here we go. If we have the um, if the KOs don't come back, then uh, we get the cool bit of text that says... Yeah, I've never I've never done that to anybody. Oh, he doesn't Aww. 
So I've the only reason in Blood Bowl 2. I've done it a lot in, in like Fumble, but I've never got to do it in Blood Bowl 2. Uh, I saw uh, Artemis did it um, recently. He did it two seasons ago, and uh, it, it was really interesting just to see it. I had never seen it before, so I went and watched the VOD. Hey! <laughs> parity, parity. Dicey, dicey, yeah. absolutely dicey. Absolutely diced. <laughs> I mean, just yeah. imagine, you know, it's just a, a rock and kills the last. Uh... Mm -hmm. Yeah, I really wanted to see just a one man pitch invasion, just the Saurus goes down. <laughs> just, just the Saurus, yeah. <laughs> like, you know, the actual, the actual the game fucking hates you. Yeah. Uh, that was really rough, man. Uh, first time in Chalice, uh, I mean, that was comedy mega, right? Yes. <laughs> yes, yes. There is, there is, I mean, there is no way that anyone can uh, defend this as not that no. was not nice. You know, there were chances here and there. He rolled triple skulls, you know? Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> no, 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 no. Oh, totally is... balanced out. The fact that he got fucking four Saurus removal in the first two turns. Yeah, he I rolled think... triple skull. I mean, come on. I think it's just uh, look. I don't know. I don't even know what you'd say to your opponent. I mean, uh, I yeah, just Bane has the right thing scoring, yeah. scoring, scoring as much thousands as possible. Get them. <laughs> <laughs> oh my god! You just saved time by just going. Now you're good. Now you're fine. Wow, 17 armor bricks. So like the last game, uh, 22. What was it? The last game were 22. 22 yeah, yeah, armor bricks. Yeah. With ball. Yeah. yeah, yeah. That was that was creepy, wasn't it? Was it creepy or was it eye raffle? Whatever. One of the, one of the matches was 22 armor bricks. Cibros. It was Cibros. It was Cibros. I I revel. Yeah. Yeah. yeah, and then he's made 70 navy breaks, but instead of doing basically nothing, he just killed his entire team. Nine casts and three chaos <laughs> from 70 navy breaks. Yeah, it was a quick god. game, Galentio. Yep, yeah, like 20 minutes. Yep. Yeah. My god. Really, wow. really harsh for this, uh, for the poor uh, Lizard. You know, how many games has the team play? How many hours, you know? Yeah. Come to Charlie, set it go. This undead, oh, this looks good. This is my chance, and yeah, you become history for the <laughs> yeah. cup. The yeah, wrong side of history, you know, just but, the wrong uh, side of it. Yeah, I mean, I hope they come back into it. Uh, it they seem to know what they were doing. Uh, well, we didn't really get a chance to see them play, did we? No, yeah, no, no. The thing is, I mean, this is the kind of game you know, when you is there is actually you know, a blue Bowl convention or something like that. And you say, I am this guy, everybody pays you a drink. Yeah. <laughs> I, I saw it, man. I saw it, man. You know, yeah. you play well, yeah. you be, oh, with dignity. That guy. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. Yeah, that was, that was something. Holy moly. I think uh, there is a serious competitor for most diced guy in the chat history. That's yep. got to be up there, yeah. That's got it. That, that was definitely one. That was... Anyway, see you later, guys. I'm leaving for good now. I have my okay. dinner. Time to, yeah. you know, well go done. to bed. Thanks yes. so much for popping in. You you were here. You saw it. I was here. I was here. History you know, in the making. Uh, I saw history in the making. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. Unbelievable! Thanks for having me. Thank you so much, Kalon. Absolutely glorious to have you here. And uh, yeah, congratulations to Vade. Commiserations to uh, Trenner. Yep. That uh, was what an absolute fucking shit show. Um, my heart goes out to you, buddy. Uh, best luck next time. Yeah, yeah, that was brutal. And uh, thanks for watching, everyone. Don't forget to leave a like and subscribe, and stay fantastic. <laughs>